So now we've talked about the custom mode, we're going to go into the preset modes, which is your harbor and offshore, which those of you that run radar uh, understand those. So when we're in harbor, it means it's going to decrease the filtering and e increase the sensitivity. So you're going to use this when you're in an area that you have very calm waters, but you might have heavy traffic and you want to be able to watch all those little pieces or all those little targets uh, without having uh, false echoes from wave heights and other objects around. Offshore again is now when we're out in the open uh, waters and we get these returns from the wave heights. So signal is bouncing back off of waves. So by going into offshore, we change the filtering to reduce that. Weather is going to set the radar up so it's really looking for what a consistency of a cloud that will hold water or rain. So weather is nice because it allows us to see the storm cells and to actually separate the high sensitivity or high density areas and the lower density areas. And then last is bird mode. Now on our dome radars, remember, you're not going to see birds uh, past a mile and a half, two miles, you're going to see them with the naked eye. But bird mode will come in handy when you're looking for those smaller targets of further distance. So it's not going to see a small bird, but it will see a small boat. It allows you to set those parameters up to see those smaller targets at a further distance. And when we go into advanced, you notice when I'm in my preset modes that most of my settings are, are grayed out. It means they're already preset by the unit when you go into those modes.